and he got to the Super Bowl in last last year to up 10 in the fourth quarter in the NFC Championship. How Why I is answer, he so bad? How do I answer that? I'll tell you how I answer it. Familiarity breeds contempt. Okay. And what's crazy, Kaylee, is that he doesn't even work out with the team. He works out on a separate field in Santa Clara. That pass is a little low, but it is caught up at the 32-yard line. Malik Turner hauling it in. 49ers use a fullback more than any team in the league. When you have use check, you might as well do that, even though that's not use check in there right now. That instead is one of the tight ends who lines up back there. That's Ross Dwelly. Half a minute to go in the quarter. They need two. Get that plus three more as Sherman goes up the middle to the 45-yard line. What do you attribute to that work in the trenches on both sides of the ball? I mean, that's who we are. I mean, that's what we practice. In order for us to have success, we have to be able to do that. Put a lot of emphasis into it. Hopefully, we'll be able to continue. On a third and one through the middle, breaking a tackle. That is Sermon. To the outside, Sermon again behind the tight end. So it's third down and seven from the 40. Pass thrown, but well short of the first down. Eight minutes to go in the opening half. Sudfeld gets it away. And can he get the first down? Yep, up to the 21-yard line. Tyler Croft. Mills on a third and seven. To the end zone, fighting for it. And then it is picked off in the end zone. In their opening preseason game and a fumble recovery in the last one against Minnesota. And that's a nice gain. And that's Jordan Mason who's making a little bit of a splash in training camp as well. Showing one guy who's going to play a big role in the backfield this season. A guy named Debo Samuel. Listed, of course, as a wide receiver. Nice little run here for a first down. See right the right guard, 74. He locks up, gets his arms on the outside, then grabs a hold of that jersey. Sounds like he's healthy, though, which is great. That's what they say. Yeah. But no takers so far. Third and 12. And that's going to be caught for a 10-yard gain, a little bit shy. Drive right beginning from the 15-yard line. Hangs in the pocket, fires into traffic, and threads it. Early in the first quarter, and that's all the scoring so far. To the outside goes the pass to the 40-yard line, but Jennings gets tackled in bounds by Green. Second and 16. Trying to set up a screen, and they do with great effectiveness. Another the screen set up here. This is hasty. He obviously gets into that backfield and becomes such a threat. Third and 12. And wide open and making the catch. Right over the middle is Ross Dwelly. New head coach, new GM, new quarterback. Anything positive, I don't care when it happens, is good news. That's not good news That's right not, there. No. 17 to nothing. Sam Mandola kicks off. From the one-yard line, the run back, Marcus Johnson. And if Trey Lance hits, it's great. It's easy. But wouldn't it be nice to have an insurance policy? No question. Sir. Third down and five. To the outside goes the pass, and it is caught. Look at him go. Brock Purdy <laughs> back in there right now. And taken off. And what would he say at about the 50? But he's going to take it all the way? Gets the Aaron snap. Collects it and picks up the first down. Nice move here. It's Turner. So some great back and forth skill. Gets into the 50 yard line. He's trying to, this guy's trying to fight to win this backup job. Snap gets through it. Doesn't panic. And not only that, instead of scrambling and just taking off, instead, vision downfield, locates the receiver, and picks up the first down. This kid, Purdy. Third down and 12. Purdy surveys, fires, caught. His good night continues. Fumagalli, the tight end, so they needed 12. Ready for, yep, ready for the ball to get in the air. 
It's in the air right here, and it's caught at the 24-yard line. It's Willie Sneed, so the only question is, can the 49ers get on the scoreboard?